that make sense? Yeah, we were well briefed in the hotel prior to our departure uh, from Edinburgh by the medical team. Uh, they were very thorough, so nobody is under any sort of illusions with regards to how serious it is um, over here in South Africa and that we've all got a duty and a role to play with regards to making sure that um, we do everything 100% by the book um, and not allow things to get stressed out or get on top of us. We realise how lucky we are to be given this opportunity um, and we've got, to, we've got to pay due diligence to all the um, restrictions and the things we've got to go through. It's, it's a way of life currently, isn't it? So, um, you know, we, we're very fortunate that, that we're here going ahead with it. Yeah, no, as far as I'm concerned, um, you know, those, those decisions aren't mine to make anyway. One thing is concrete, we had a good session this morning, um, so I'm pretty, hard, pretty glad uh, that that's going well, you know. We had a few new, um, five new members joining the party uh, following the game against Japan, so it's good to get them bedded into some training uh, and get some hard work done. Yeah, we, we didn't um, spend that long talking about it. Obviously, we had to uh, make a decision pretty quickly uh, on the run. Uh, there were a number of candidates that were discussed. Um, but Connor, because of his experience, he came out on top, really. Um, I'm sure Warren will be able to explain uh, a little bit further. But, um, yeah, as, as far as I go, you know, it was a quick discussion amongst us to discuss those uh, outstanding candidates. Um, and then Warren made the call on, uh, on Connor. Yeah, everyone's available. Um, we're in a in a good place. Everybody's been given a fit bill of health, so um, it's good to get going. You know, we've arrived in South Africa now. We've had our first session under under our belts. Um, we're familiar with the hotel. We've, we're familiar with the the routine that we're going to fall into. Um, so um, from here on in, really, it should be. Uh, I'm not quite confident enough to say plain sailing um, because anything can happen really quickly. Uh, however, uh, we, we're comfortable in our surroundings, uh, we know what's ahead of us, uh, so we, we've just got to roll our sleeves up now and get on with Thank you. Robert, how have the uh, new members settled in for training us? Yeah, it's good. Obviously, um, three of those members, they've been uh, regularly updated with regards to being involved in, in various WhatsApp groups. Um, so it's just Josh and Adam, really, who had to learn everything from new, from scratch. Um, but in fairness to all the boys, they, they're uh, helping each other out. They're sitting in front of the, the laptops in the analysis room, bringing them up to speed. Um, so, you know, on the basis of this morning, um, good, you know. Um, we're not expecting too much. I'm not putting too much pressure. But uh, slowly but surely, I'm sure they'll be, they'll be get, getting there. And, you know, by, the, by midweek, I expect that uh, they'll be fully up to speed. Well, yeah, the test is when we play, isn't it? Um, and in fairness to Japan, they provided the test that we thought they were going to uh, provide us. You know, the World, World Rugby World Cup quarter finalists uh, that are strengthened in their own right. Um, yes, they pose different uh, threats to what we're going to be faced out here in South Africa. But I thought it was, as a run out for us, um, you know, by the two injuries, obviously, um, which were disappointing. Uh, I thought the questions they asked of us um, were great because. You know, we, we know we're not where we want to be uh, yet. Uh, there's a bit of work to do. So, you know, to play against a quality team uh, like Japan, um, at least it gives us something to work with uh, and work towards. With it. They put us under pressure, um, ask questions of us in, in numerous facets of play. So, um, no, but really happy that we stood, uh, stood and we came through it, you know. Um, like I said, the, the, there's areas that we need to improve on. However... That was the first game after everybody coming in, um, you know, 10-day prep or whatever it was. 
So um, it's good to have something to work with, um, and we look forward to look forward to the next test, which is on Saturday.